Hello everybody and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. I am currently finalizing the edits for this in a hotel room because I have started work once more. So yay for me on that front, honestly. I'll be working in Arizona. I've never worked in Arizona and I've been wanting to for many years, so I'm very excited. Um, this does mean that things are gonna probably be sporadic again uh, as I can get service to upload videos. Um, I am lucky enough that apparently this company that I'm with right now, they use Starlink while in the field, so I can potentially upload videos, no, like at least while I'm at work. So we'll see how that goes. I don't know how much access I have to it. But um, anyway, yeah, we're still in the middle of doing the Dangnab Orthon shenanigans, which believe me, we're shenanigans and a half. So uh, buckle up. Get ready for more secrets, honestly, and revealing of said secrets, hopefully, a little bit. So, thank you all uh, for dealing with this intro, and uh, the video will start in a moment. I don't know what constitutes running away, but I am... Oh, there's somebody you can... What? That's hilarious. Twisted marrow throw. Ooh, a rat. I have, I have, um, speaking with animals on. Let's talk to, oh, there's a rat. It's a little rat king and little rat people. Unworthy. Unworthy to walk among friendly bones. Leave. Oh. Uh, what are you talking about? I'm talking of you, intruder, invader, unworthy one. These halls are not for you. Homest. Very well. We outnumber you. Leave me be. Back off. Try it. A lot more guts than you'd expect. A lot more. Mm, okay, maybe I don't want to do that. But I do want to... These guys are not letting me get to the throat. Wow, there are so many bodies down here. This is, this is crazy. Unworthy of dark cloak. Unworthy of dark fur. Unworthy. There's something strange yeah. about the vermin in this place. I can't put my finger on what, though. Uh, why is it... Wait, is it Shadowheart that's... Talking? I thought I had Halson clicked, but apparently not. And she doesn't have an animal speak... Speaks with animals, but she can understand? <laughs> well... Oh no! Yeah, it is Halson. But, um. He has opinions. Or, uh, Shadowheart has opinions, rather. Interesting. The rat isn't merely territorial, it's proud. This place means a great deal to it. Let's see. The rat holds its ground. Meh. It almost seems defiant. Yeah, well, why? This place it seems important to you. Why? We've always been here. It's ours. We watch over it. You do not belong. Unwelcoming vermin aside, we need to explore this place. Leave. Away. My nest. My dark. Tristan. I don't want to start a fight up here. Not right now. We'll look around. We'll look around. Maybe there's more clues. This is like this is the Hall of Heroes. Maybe can Halson turn into a rat? I don't I'm think so. Oh, he can turn into a cat. Oh, that's those those devil masks that we saw earlier in the Underdark. Scroll of Planar Binding. Oh my gosh. I almost kind of want to save that for Gale to learn. This one we can maybe trade with? As weird as that sounds? Detect thoughts. Why not? I'm just... Okay. Fear master's coffers tend to his beast. Feeded potions. Ooh, I should talk to the Displacer it Beast. Seems this Merrigan is using potions to charm a beast on behalf of its master. Hmm. 
Oh! I am to tend to your master's beast now. Give me the potions. Hey! Go back up <laughs> where we were. These were the stairs. The desire is there, but it doesn't have any potions to give. Hmm. Okay. Oh! I did get it. I got a Marigum potion, I guess. This! Come here, Displacer Beast. I must speak with you. What business Woo! do you have in my master's den? I didn't think of you. I can ask you the same question. That's much more polite. I am my master's heart chosen. He smells sour milk and rot on its breath. This creature has been eating charmed spider meat. Hmm. Ooh. Rough. Uh, persuasion. You only love your master because he's been doing dousing this meat. He's manipulating you. Let's see. Can I add any other bonuses? Heck yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Woo, baby. Maybe I get to have a good laser beam friend? Ooh. That would be cool. I remember. Quick flesh. Hot blood. Before master, my prey was alive. False master, hind-legged liars all! I'll shred you! Uh-oh. Uh, yeah, ooh, yeah, let's- Only liar here is your master, let's end him together. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'm gonna need- Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Nope, absolutely not even close. Not even close. Please let me have a reroll. I want this desperately. I will use up all my inspiration on it if I must. Oh my god, please. I'm gonna have to roll like an 18 or higher. Oh gosh, I'm doing so badly. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, you guys. I freaking, I, 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 I legitimately, I reloaded for these, for this because I wanted it to work. Uh, I actually played it, I tried to play it out a bit, but like, like, when I failed the roll, but we were getting destroyed! And I was like, oh my gosh! So I came back, it was reloading a bit. If nothing else, I did think I have, I, I realized after, like, like a minute ago, I was like, I have that scroll that lets me, like, make something be my, like, to tie them to being my friend or something, um, because the speaks with, an or the charm animals or whatever thing that he has only works with an intelligence Creature with an intelligence level of three or lower, and this creature's intelligence is a six. So, it wasn't working. And I was like, ah! And so we were getting destroyed. So let's see how this goes. I know it's not D&D-esque to, like, reload, but listen, is I want, I wanted this, okay? Let's see how it plays, let's see how this plays out. <sighs> There's yes. truth in yes, you, Yes, there is! <laughs> I'll not start the fight, but I'll help you end it. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you, because we were all, like, we got, like, jumped in, and I was like, ah, like, I still want to kind of look around, but I was going to play it out. I was like, all right, we're not going to get the details, like, whatever, but, like, this is good. This is good. This is playing out. I was really stressed. Honestly, my neck was, like, hurting. I was like, man, like, I was not doing well. Let's see if there's any secrets. I think there's gotta be something- oh, well, there's gotta be something in here, maybe? Except, um, people don't want me to do anything with it? Let's see. Asterion. No. Actually, we, the rest of us need to go away. This, this will be easier if we're not lighting the entire place it's not up. over, then through. So, if we can get a Asterion well, to crouch. Ooh. The displacer beast shouldn't be a problem, but we need to wait till this thing moves away. What are they exactly? A fiend? Okay. Crouch, crouch, crouch. Let's do. Yes. Boots of brilliance, tiny bells, bardic inspiration. Well, that's it. Man, I was hoping for a secret. This is horrifying. A bed made of corpses. 
disgusting and uncomfortable. And uncomfortable. That is very important to point out. I don't know. Like, we're not supposed to leave the area, and I am... Um, you can only leave and kill the last Sharan residence. We discovered signs of destruction. Yeah. Blah, blah. I... The only thing I can think of is this structure, this, 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 whatever this is, a throne up here. Because anywhere else, there's, there's not really anywhere else to go. At least that's not what it, that's what it looks like, you know? Oh, there's, I saw this on the way in. There is this, there is this door here. And something down here. I was like, there's gotta be something on the outside here. And lo and behold, there is. Um, I don't think any of us have... Like, a nice, easy... Oh, but I might have a scroll. Stop. Stop trying to jump. Okay, let's try a scroll of feather fall. Alright. Okay, I can give everybody... A potion of feather fall. Okay. Oh, all right. It was actually really stressful. <laughs> I was like, I don't know, I'm gonna get everybody over there. But he has enhanced sleep, and I'm just big and beefy and strong. Have a lot of my all mind. All right. What have then we well, got here? Really. Better not be cursed. The mirrors here seem to not reflect light, but devour it. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Swift as my feet can carry me. This door didn't seem locked per se. Ah, I'm just making sure there's not anything out here. I should definitely quick save. Definitely quick save before I start opening mysterious doors. I hope this isn't part of the Char gauntlet. <laughs> It's definitely a Char thing. Reflections upon the mirror of loss. So there's a mirror of loss. There's a gilded chest. I feel like we should read the book. Read. The original purpose of the sacred mirror has been lost to the ages. Some suppose that it was a result of Telamat Tanthul's attempt to, de to delve into the Shadowfell itself in the time before the folly of his master, Karsis. Others claim it only became an object of devotion after the fall of Netheril, when the lost stricken survivors of the floating cities found comfort in Lady Shar's embrace. I remember that vaguely from Will, or uh, what's his name, Gale, telling us. Um, what is certain is that many of Nightsinger, Nightsinger, oh, Nightsinger's faith will claim to feel some echo of her power and majesty when in the presence of the mirror, even though it is shattered. They are often said to feel lesser once they step away from the mirror, hence the name has, it has become commonly known by our scholars continue to study it, but alas, its true nature may continue to elude us. Perhaps if the Dark Lady indulges us, she shall reveal another of those holy relics for us, so we may feel the full power of her embrace. Nerds. Mm, so that's the mirror over yonder. Someone there. So we nice. have the night song still going on, and there was something about it being um like we had an, a little update to it in the journal apparently. Holy moly! Oh hi kitty. Yeah, I hear you. Let's hope Asterian. Yeah, we can try again. Okay. That was a bad roll. He's normally not like this. He's just a little spooked. It's a cracked mirror. I'm gonna definitely have do? Shadow Heart poke it. Another step forward. Char mural. In darkness, truth. In shadows, justice. In the dark lady's name. Always. Okay. Silver key. Can I have I'll it? I'll take that. I know we're supposed to usually be turning them off, but I don't know, like it's like Zelda instincts. If, if I can turn a fire thing on, I'm gonna turn it on. Can we turn all the lights off? I somehow accidentally I think I turned off her daylight. I don't know how I did that. I pressed F or something. 
Well, I've turned off all the lights in here and out there by the other mirror. I don't even think I can like pick that one up. I was saying I could cast darkness, but this one's broken. And I can't fix it that I know of. Oh! What if I come in here and close the door, maybe? I don't know if I can. Yeah, I don't know. There's like something about another relic, maybe, in this book. There's the Char mural that's like in darkness. Things are whatever figured out, but I'm just a silly little guy and uh, I, I can't figure it out. So alas, this is not gonna have the answers I was hoping for apparently and now I gotta friggin figure out how to get back over all right so I've managed to fly across with oh hey okay apparently there is a way down and around okay well this is cool let's turn off flying Is that blood? You over here also. No, never mind. Uh, these ones, Keep your distance, I think girl. I'm going to need to use... Yeah, he can't make the jump. Okay. She Whatever it takes. might make the jump. No. Oh, yeah, she has Misty Step. You can Misty Step her across. And Asterion has um, an arrow of like relocation. That I, you know, didn't transposition. Didn't want to use it necessarily, but here we are. I really don't know how else to get him around, <laughs> to get him in here. There's stuff here. Or we can go down here, which looks a mite bit dead endy, so I'm gonna maybe do this first. Oh, oh, up uh, another way, all right. Or down here. Okay, this is not dead endy. Oh my gosh, where does this, this goes many a place. Okay, I'm, I'm committing. Um, up this side, which leads to who knows what, what is this? Is this This looks Gauntlet of Shari. Ob I mean, obviously all of it does. Oh, there's more rats. Hang on, okay, hang on. I wanna go over here. This looks interesting. A broken effigy. A ritual circle. Seems to be inferno in nature. Oh, book. Oops. Oh, a break in the con- We found the contract thing. A final ah! Offer us peace now. Or be devoured. What the heck? You're no ordinary rat, are you? None of you are. An ordinary rat alone. But together, something more. Some remember turning away from the sun. Some remember donning a black cloak. Some remember plunging a blade into an innocent heart. Are these shards? But we all remember a name. Lethindor. We share who he was. Oh. Are you telling me one person turned into a swarm of rats? How can that be? It shouldn't be. We should be one long dead. Instead, we are many. Scurrying. Hiding. Surviving. We are just crumbs of a life. Harmless nothings. Unless you test us. Leave us in peace. I just wanted to read the book. I let you live within it there for me. There are treasures. Useless to us now, but once they had value. Meaning. We hid them away. Untouched for a lifetime. Keep your word, and we will reveal them to you. What? Keep what word? Your lives for this treasure. I'm not trying to kill them. Sure. And you better be true to your word. <laughs> I am small, but we are many. Now fetch your prize and leave. What's my prize? I just wanted to read the book. Can I not? Oh. 
one becomes many. Hang on, I'm quick saving again. So that it might have been the action of reading. Parts and multitudes that form our thoughts, desires, na nature itself, manifold other creatures inside of you. Oh, Raphael. And what you can become when you speak my words is all your parts made manifest. Your weakness can become strength if it is made legion. Quaking hearts can find courage in their numbers. The lowliest vermin can humble a Goliath if they stand as an army and a ruin can become a kingdom for one soul made many. Speak this thrice, become your finest self, all of them, Raphael. He speaks of magic that can divide someone into many. But many won't. Well, hopefully I didn't peeve off the rats there. Okay, so this is a oh way. So something about the break your gears contract completely made a deal with the rats. Wait, what did I break? I didn't want to break his contract. He is Orthon is bound by Raphael's contract and seeks to away free himself and came upon a mysterious ritual site. It seems one of the Orthon's targets has assumed. A new shape. Oh, this is okay. So that's it. Did sound like he was because he's like, oh, we've donned a black cloak. We plunged a knife into the heart of an innocent. Um, I was like, oh, that must be a Shar person. Um, we learned that the rats in the Gauntlet of Shar are actually one single person, a man named Mithindor, and he is probably the la he is the last Sharin in the area, and so. That is who this guy hasn't killed yet. He hasn't killed the rats because he doesn't know that they are a, an actual person. So interesting, Raphael is playing quite a long con. We made a deal with the rats in return for being left alone. They told us about a cache of hidden treasure. Um, yeah, I don't want to break it. Hopefully I am not doing that. I gotta go check, like, pronto. Um. That I didn't actually break. I know how to break it, but that doesn't mean I want to. Because I told him, I told him I'd leave the rats alone. So we should be <laughs> not dealing with rats. Oh, the rats are gone. <clears throat> From here, I'm, uh, I, uh, I may be going too far. Each trial shall yield an umbral gem. Each gem shall bring the victor closer to the Night Singer. The final sacrifice beckons, and the Salunite blood shall herald the rise of a new Dark Dust Justicia. Okay. Nothing of value comes easy. Overcome my trials. No! This is, this is, this is all too much. I need to go figure out what I did with the Orthon first. This is Sharon stuff. I don't want to, I don't want to mess with that. Yet. A Zealot of the Absolute. Oh Trust, yeah, this, I haven't been in here yet. Oh, instructions, amulet. Investigate strange singing. Assert, ascertain any connection to the relic. Do not deviate. Do not fail. Return promptly. Okay. Open up. Unfortunate. They got put into a gazillion little pieces of undead slaying. Arcane interference. Okay. Phew. I was like, I don't know if we're going to be able to get out of here. Hopefully this takes us out where we want to go. Back over by the Displacer Beast is where the treasure is? Oh, is it... Is it in there? There! Is that... That can't be the treasure. It must be buried. It would have gone away, I would assume, if that was it. And that's that was really crummy. If that is... It can't be it. 
I think that's apparently the stash, which is quite disappointing. Well, I'm gonna like hard save here. And talk to him and see what he has to say. It seems like he's not free, but I just want to make sure. You're supposed to be searching for okay. ruins, metal rabbit. Given up already. Can we please kill it this time? Yeah, but I kind of want to put you guys up on a different place. Make sure it works through the door. Okay, I think I do. We're just going to. Did Shadowheart get caught up in it too? Turn off the torches here so that he has a shadowy spot with which to play. Okay. Halson probably needs to stay here. And Shadowheart looks like she's stuck. Maybe? No, she's not stuck. She's also kind of a melee gal, though. I kind of need her here. And with that, we'll have to go ahead and cut it off there. As you can tell, we're about to start instigating a fight with the Orthon, so uh, we'll just have to see how that goes in the next part. So thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. Really quick, one want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, including my Acorn Tier patrons. Thank you so much, Fane, for your support. I very much appreciate it. And I want to give an extra special shout out to my Sapling Tier patron, Reese Galito. Thank you so much for your support. I very much appreciate it as well. And I want to give an extra, extra special shout out to Christopher, my Forest Tier patron, who has gone above and beyond in his support of me and the channel, and who I truly cannot thank enough. So thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.